Thank you, President. I rise today to pay my respects to the life of a selfless woman in my electorate by the name of Ruth Isbell. Ruth passed away after a short illness at her home in Crosley at the young age of 58. As one publication put it, Ruth changed the southwestern region forever. She was the CEO of Emma House after her dedicated work at Brophy House of over 20 years service. She served a life dedicated to protecting women and children going through family violence and in child protection during her successful career. I met Ruth in February last year and was blown away by her dedication to the sector. As always, when I speak to veterans in the sector, they tell me funding doesn't keep up with demand. This was and still is the case for Emma House. It is timely that all Orange Door services have had their leases signed and a commitment from this government to have them all completed by the end of 2022. When I spoke to Ruth about Orange Door services, she cautioned that with their opening, we shouldn't forget that outreach is a big part of family violence, that we still need to provide access to women and children who are in remote areas and not just open a shop front. I'll keep fighting for family violence funding, as I know Ruth did until her recent tragic passing. My condolences to Ruth's family and friends. Rest in peace.